got a call from a trucking firm. They've got a tractor trailer broke down by the Astoria Bridge. They, I guess from what happened was they uh, pulled off the shoulder of the road and got the truck and trailer stuck. They just said they're stuck in the shoulder of the road, but I just got another call from a, my painter who's going back from Portland. He said the trailer's at a 45 degree angle, so I might have to go back to get my Class C wrecker. I was just going to do a uh, pull out from the mud, but this thing might be a little more, a little more buried than that. Uh, Passed the Chinook Tunnel here about a mile on the left hand side of the road. They pulled off the Astoria Bridge and hit a soft spot in the shoulder. He was just checking his direction when he pulled over. He's thinking. Oh, it should come right out. I don't know if we have any problem with that. Oh, he really did, Earl. I'll get turned around. I think we'll. A light pull should do it. He didn't mention he was sitting at a pretty good angle here, but I think I think if we just get a chain on, we should be able to pull him straight out. How you doing, Carlo? Holy shit! Yeah, he didn't say it was down like that, but. Uh, I think we'll be okay. I'm just going to double chain you down there, put it in four wheel drive. I'm just going to ease on it real easy. I think as long as we just turn your wheels just a tiny bit, I think we should call right out, okay? Let's see here. This thing's almost at a 45. Pull that cord out of there a little more. Yours will get it out. <laughs> yeah, you see where your tire is. Your one tire got in that mud that just sucked you right over, didn't it? Yeah. I'm just going to put it low range four wheel drive. I want you to go ahead and start it up. Get all your brakes released. And uh, when you're ready, just tap your horn. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put it in first gear and just ease on your gas. And with me hooked like this, we we don't want to turn your wheels hard. We want to keep it just about like you are right now. Okay. We're just going to try and crawl out of the ditch. You turn hard, that's what happened here. You start sliding sideways. Maybe if you straighten it out, it might, you know. Well, you straighten it out still. Well, once you're stuck in, you're in, but with me pulling there, it should come out. Okay. You start to crank his wheel too hard and left, you tell him to straighten him out a little bit, okay? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Try to give it some juice. Keep going.
You're all the way out. Huh? You're all the way out. Piece of cake. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> that, that worked out great, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, that's good. No damage. Yeah, that's good. That's good. <laughs> We'll see you later. You know where you're headed? Yeah, I'm, I'm going to uh, Chinook, Chinook. Oh, Chinook. you go to Chinook? Yeah. Oh, you're just four miles down the road. You got her. I'll see you later. Take care. Bye. There goes Carlos. Getting the load in Chinook, Washington. So he's only got just a couple of miles to go and he's good to go.